Well, we certainly live in interesting times and not fun times. I decided to stay with my plans and went to Scotland for a bachelor party last weekend. No kidding. It was fun and was a great bonding experience with my future son-in-law. I hope he feels the same way. The return was hassle-free, but it was a different country I returned to from the one I left Thursday night. School, restaurant, store, and theater closings, to mention a few, plus shelter-in-place orders added to the panic. And talk about panic. Senior care and health care read stocks were pummeled more than any other sector. Yes, the 80-plus population is more at risk, and we did have that unfortunate spread of the virus in the Kirkland, Washington nursing facility. But sending wheat stocks down by more than 50% on average in two weeks? The same for the provider stocks? Either this is a buying opportunity of a lifetime, or we are going to have some major corporate disruption in our sector. I hope it is the former. Some of you have reached out and asked if all is okay. Thank you. I'm glad to say yes, all well here other than being a little tired from the weekend, not to mention the Nick conference the week before. But because of four international airports and two international flights in five days, I've decided to work outside the office for the next two weeks, just to be prudent. But I will always be available and will be monitoring what all this means for the senior care investment market. That is what I love to do. So stay tuned and thank you LTC Properties for your antibacterial wipes. They were very handy on the airplanes.